Uh, Sheikh, uh, please uh, share with us a guideline uh, to uh, pull the ties of kinship uh, with the uh, uh, kinship that are non mahram for example, cousins and uh, so on. Uh, like, are we allowed to, uh, if we meet them at uh, any gathering, are we allowed to talk to them or say salam or like, what is the uh, guideline? Barakallah. Wa feekum barakallah. Akhi, Islam sets the guidelines for Muslims that protect them from any wrongdoings or fitna. So when the Prophet والسلام, said in an authentic hadith, nisa, do not enter upon women folk, meaning don't enter upon non mahrams. So a man stood up and said, O Prophet of Allah, الحمو, what about my brother, my uncle? My cousin, who are in-laws of my wife, are they exempted from this prohibition? The Prophet said, alayhi salatu wasalam, alhamu al-maut. Those you're referring to are death. If you want death to get in contact with your wife, in this case, allow them in. Otherwise, the brother-in-law is more dangerous than a total stranger. I'm a total stranger. Your wife would have hundreds and thousands of reservations before lowering her guard, but not the same reservations when it's your brother or your cousin or your uncle because he's family. And this is what shaitan utilizes the most. So to answer your question, Salihin, when you come in contact with female cousins, you don't have to chit chat with them if it's an open area, you just give Jalal salam, assalamu alaikum. You don't have to go, Fatima, my cousin, what's happening? Haven't seen you for so long. God, you've gained weight. MashaAllah, you still look young. Hey, hey, hold your horses. What are you doing? He said, Sheikh, um, I'm just trying to be, you know, uh, 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 friendly. No, this is not permissible. This is haram interaction with the opposite gender. You enter, you say, assalamu alaikum. You meet her with her uh, husband or uh, uh, siblings in a public place. She says, Salaamu Alaikum, how are you, Salih? You say, Alaikum Salaam, cuz, Alhamdulillah. That's it. But do not go the extra mile and Allah knows best.